first couple of weeks preseason, and just the relationship between you and Brock and the growth you've seen him have on and off the field. Yeah, man. Um, Got to be honest with Brock, he was pretty great the day he showed up, you know what I'm saying? Uh, that dude's like been making plays from day one. Uh, so, I mean, to get him in game situations, to have the trust in him, has really been easy, man. He's earned it the whole time, and uh, it's really cool to have a guy like that on your team. What's impressed you most just about him on the field uh, and his skill set? Uh, I don't know, man. He's, he's like, he wins in zone, feel, has feel for zone, or wins in man, has feel for zone, and uh, has some catch and run juice to him. Um, I, I was excited to see how much like juice he had after some of his first down catches, you know, like getting up, being fired up. That was uh, that was awesome to see. You played for some teams that have good home field advantages. What is your anticipation for being in a legion for the first time in a regular season game? No, I'm so fired up to get home home opener. Uh, everybody says we're gonna have a great crowd, man. I'm ready to hear it, ready to see it, ready to feel it. Uh, it means a lot to us, and we want to make this one of those places you know we want to make our home field a true home field and something that we love coming back to and uh you know it's on us to make it that way it's, it's, Devontae, it's, it's so one of the veterans the leaders the captains to instill a message if it's even needed that hey this week's panthers could be last week's raiders nobody expected y'all to win nobody expects them to win. you have to kind of go in there with that mentality yeah absolutely i mean I, that's every week you got to earn it there's no free passes in this league like it doesn't matter who you are, you know what I'm saying? Everybody's good in this league. Everybody can win in this league. So we got to have a great week of practice, and we got to show up, and we got to play our best ball. And, uh, Small sample size, Gardner, but through two weeks, you're second, tied for second in the league in passing yards. What does that mean? To you? Uh, nothing, really, yeah. you know. I wish we were 2-0. <laughs> what does it mean for the team's success, though, offensively? Uh, I don't know, probably run the ball a little more. <laughs> <laughs> you, you're also completing a high percentage of your uh, passes as well. And you talked during training camp about wanting to maybe be a point guard type quarterback. Is that kind of the byproduct of that spraying the ball around, being that facilitator? I think so, man. We've been seeing some uh, kind of softer zone coverages. They've been keeping a top on things. I think we did a better job last game of when we got our one-on-ones, taking shots downfield. Um, but I think the big part, you know, especially when they're running and like hitting the way, you got to keep it on track. You know, keep us in second and you know seven or better, and then third down five or better. Like just keeping us in manageable downs, uh, I think is is really important for, for our success. How big of a deal was Max's pep talk to you after the interception early on for the rest of the game? No, it was awesome, man. He grabbed me and just said, "Hey, we got your back, dude." Like. We need that Washington State Gardner. We need that, you know. And uh, I was like, man, you're right, dude. Let me see if I can go whip that up real quick. But uh, nah, man, that dude's a great leader. He, he does it the right way, man. And uh, couldn't be couldn't be more grateful to have him on our team. After that conversation, there was like some motivation that happened because lots of changes with your offense. And there's kind of a rhythm that we all had an opportunity to see. How do you build from that going on to this next game? Yeah. I think it's uh, just about consistency, you know. I think there's a lot of things we did well. Um, and, you know, just kind of getting into that flow sooner, you know, finding that confidence sooner. Uh, in both these games, it's taken us way too long. So I think just understanding that we have that when we are dialed in on our details, just we got to have that from each other. Gardner, to that point, what changed for you guys in the fourth quarter? Obviously, things kind of started going your way. What, what did you guys do differently? Uh, I don't know, man. Um, I mean, you're calling the same plays. We got the same guys out there. I think it's just literally do it. Everybody being on the same page, you know. Um, I put a lot of trust in those receivers, and they paid me back for it. You know, I think that's a big part of it. The line held up, and we blocked really well down the stretch. Like, yeah, I think everybody just taking their play to the next level. And that's what it's going to take. That's good. Right. Thank, Thank you. Thank you.